Today on Ever Wonder, we're going to find out how maple syrup is made. Kristen and Andy run Journeys and Maple Farm, and they'll show us how it's done. Maple syrup comes from maple trees. The first step is to drill a hole in the tree and put a spile in so the sap can drip into buckets. Tubing can also be used to collect the sap. Farmers go around gathering the sap from the trees. Then they pump the sap into the sap house. It goes through a filter and then into a big storage tank outside. For sap to turn into syrup, it must be boiled for a long time. These machines are called evaporators. They have many channels to help take the water out of the sap. Andy waits for the bubbles to look just right. He then tests the syrup to see if it drips off the pan and sheets. This process is called sheeting or a maple syrup drip test. After going through the evaporator, the sap is transferred and boiled again in the finishing pan. Here, Kristen stirs and uses a hydrometer to check the thickness of the syrup. Then, after the bottles have been sanitized, they are filled with maple syrup and eventually brought to pancakes everywhere.